surrounded and tired, Siri collapsed in the swamp. Some peasants found her and took her to the Baron, Velen's self-appointed ruler. The warlord took the young woman in, had her nursed back to health, then sent her on her way to Novigrad. Wonderful. They hate you too, fat girl. Ever heard the legends of the White Wolf? Sick. <sighs> Sick of it all. with a very important client. Do not disturb them. I can see it in your face. You mean me to grab another lass to join us? <laughs> no, I was thinking it'd be us two and you. Oh, all right. But what with the state you two are in, you've got to fluff each other first. Wanna dip your dingle? It's a material world. No one will hear you, bitch. Not a soul. You, though? Whole town will hear you in a minute. Yet again you disturb me. And I so dislike being disturbed. I was to play with sweet Nettie, render her not so sweet, but I shall see to you first. First, gotta tell me why you do it. For pleasure. Satisfaction. Achievable with whores in a lot of ways. Many traditional. Doesn't take killing them, trust me. Who said anything about killing? I could stop at a few burns. Third degree, but still. Mm, this rosy skin will roast quite well. Just can't listen to any more of this shit. No one's forcing you to, Newton. Free now. Oh, thank you. Thank you. If not for you. He asked if I did everything, and I said, for the right price, of course. And then he smiled. Oh, God, it gave me the shivers. And then he hit me so hard I passed out. I was bound when I came to. And he was here in the poker, in the fire! <laughs> Calm down. He won't hurt you anymore. He won't hurt anyone.
black ones, Redanians. As long as they pay and don't hit. Like rain. Got my eye on you, white one. I'm naked. Help, save me. I'm dying. with a library. Imagine that. Vile times when beggars could put letters together and foul their minds. The fire will cleanse them all. Better, right? Y yes. Did you take care of what I asked? Yeah. The witch's way. Thank you, Geralt. For me and Priscilla. Don't mention it. Nothing a friend wouldn't do. She's talking again. Nice surprise. Isn't it? Professor Von Gratz told me her wounds are healing faster than a troll's. Not the most flattering comparison, but encouraging. Maybe she might even sing again someday. For now, we'll try performing as a duo. She'll play the lute, I'll sing. Dandelion and Kalanetta. Got a nice ring to it, doesn't it? Sounds great. Good luck, Dandelion, on stage and off. Geralt? Sorry, Geralt. My throat's still quiet. Say no more. Get well soon. Yes, Geralt? Found and killed the murderer. It was Nathaniel. Caught him red-handed at Kate's. He was just about to cut into his next victim. Innkeeper wanted to keep me out. Important customer, he said. I thought nothing could surprise me in Novigrad. Seems I was wrong. Deeply wrong. Thank you, Geralt. Were it not for you, this would never have ceased. Hubert told me about your past. Even more vivid than I'd assumed. I have not time for riddles, Geralt. Be straight or be gone. Any truth to his claim that people died during the riots at the university? Died for your cause? I was young and stupid. I thought a better future was worth any price. Even a human life or two. But those are past sins. Sins I've atoned for.
Why is the university in Oxenford closed? Because it suits Radovid. You've not heard the story? The rector wished to grant him an honorary doctorate. The faculty disagreed. Nonetheless, Radovid arrived for the ceremony, donned a gown, collected his diploma, and when it was over, imprisoned the deans and the entire academic senate so they wouldn't raise a stink. I've been at Vilmerius Hospital ever since. But perhaps it's for the best. I'm far more adept scalpel in hand than I ever was behind a lectern. Know another surgeon from Oxenford Academy. Her name's Shani. Know her? Red hair cropped short, freckles. And a hopeless idealist. Naturally, I know her. She was my assistant for a year. Any idea where she is now? My gut tells me she's somewhere along the front, patching up pikemen. I told her it would be futile. In the time she saved a hundred lives, another thousand would be lost. But medics with a mission. You can't argue with them. Farewell. Ride. Like to race again. Excellent. Don't go anywhere. We'll start soon. Your opponent this time, Viscount Roma astride Caniculus. The Viscount races incognito, so I must ask for your discretion.
Hear ye, hear ye. The final of the Erasmus Vagelbart Memorial Derby is over. The winner is Geralt of Rivia, riding Roach's glory to the victor. Bravo, congratulations, you won in style. Shall I sign you up for another? I'll try again. Gained an appetite, have we? Your opponent this time, Luke Vagelbart, young Lord Albert's cousin, atop Succubus. He's the black sheep of the family, but he's not lost a race yet, so he's seen as something of a local champion. Three, one, two, three, off you go! The Erasmus Vagelbart Memorial Derby is over. The winner is Geralt of Rivia, riding Roach's glory to the victor. Fantastic race. Congratulations. A grand victory. Captured and displayed in the sideshow of a circus. Well... It could be quite profitable. Well, well. Geralt of Rivia. Got it right. What do you want? To express my admiration on account of your victory. And here. Brought you an invitation from the boss. He'd like to congratulate you personally. Farewell. Congratulations. Quite the winner, the Vagal Buds. Luke's one hell of a prick, but I don't recall him ever losing before. 
And seeing as you outran him, you actually stand a chance at Palio. Make some real coin. Palio? Never heard of it. Fuck me, what a peasant. The Palio's a race held at night in the city streets. Used to be every district sponsored a competitor. Things are different now. You're gonna race jockeys put forward by Bedlam and Reuven. But my coin's on you. Fine, I'll race. Lovely. Colour me thrilled. Just don't bloody let me down, cos I'm about to bet a small fortune on you. Go prepare. Drink some chamomile or whatever the fuck you do. The patio is above all a race of honor. The winner doesn't just win a reward, he earns our respect as well. So, take your positions and get the fuck going. Better luck next year. Great fuck. Could have whittled myself a jockey out of birch, stained him with piss, and he would have done better than you. Shit happens. Oh, you sure fucking do. That's business. Sometimes you keep the cow, sometimes it keeps you. Temple guard, scatter! I'm fucking done here. Stay out of my way for a while. Can we talk? Hi. 
Long as it's short and to the point, cos I don't wag me tongue for jollies. They call me Radko. I arrange the horse races here. You must have heard talk. Wanna try? Say the word. Don't sod off. Wanna sign up? Don't need no signing. Long as you're here come sunset and bring gold for the betting. Ah, oh, finally here. Rules are simple. Choose who you're going to run against, make your wager, then ride to Blackbow and back. First the winner, second the bleeding cunt. Got it? So, who are you going to race? Stuttering Mamamatko, Iron Arse Hands, or Black Bogdan? I'll take Stuttering Matt. Yeah, 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 you'll see. I, 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 I'll. Ah, fuck it. Come on, let's set the wager and get racing. Take it easy. Nice, nice. You seem to know horses as well as you do monsters. Here's your gold. And if the urge to race again grabs you, come see me. Right. <laughs> Who else is racing? What's the matter? A monster bothering you? Nay, a ghost. Can you tell me anything more? You see, Jackamar haunts my dreams. Jackamar's my husband, or was till he died at war. He stands by me headboard and wails. So many years apart, I've such woe in the beyond. Come join me. I say, I'll come, Jackamar, but when the gods summon me, not before. Then he says, leave your wedding ring by me grave. It'll make the white and lighter. And I'd leave it, were the woods not so terrifying. So, I thought to myself, maybe you. Sure it's your husband's ghost? You saying I can't tell me own man? I'm old, but I ain't gone daft yet. Not what I meant. There's wraiths that deceive, assume the form of dead loved ones. Troes, for instance, or dunnies. Nay, I'm sure this is Jackamore. In me dreams, he spoke of our nuptials, how we danced at Bellatine, how the Redanians killed him at Rind. Rind? You've either mixed something up or you're very old indeed. Battle happened 80 years ago. Oh, why? Slip of the tongue. Meant to say the Battle of Rivia. Be glad to help. Where's Jackamar buried? A little cemetery near Blackbow, in a grave neath the old tree. Here, take me ring. Once you've laid it down, come to me for your reward. 
We live in a hut in the middle of the village with my granddaughter, Lessie. usually corpses. At last, will ye forgive me? Already have. Show me what you got. What brings ye? Lessie, right? Wanted to talk to your grandma. To my... But she's been dead for years. Guess I talked to a ghost. Why wasn't she buried alongside her husband? I can't say for certain. I was a little lass then. But me mum told me that shortly before Gran died, she learned Grandad had kept lovers on the side. She had no desire to lie beside him. Seems she changed her mind. She wanted something to connect her and her husband in the afterlife. Asked me for help. It's hard to believe. But you've an honest look about you. If you helped Gran, you deserve a reward. Here, take much, but I'm afraid it'll have to do. First the army's passed, then the pops, now the younger. Grim Reaper must be having a war. 